such a sunny day and they are working like crazy so I guess I will be getting the suit out and opening their hive up just a little bit. Now why I am getting the suit out is as you can see I can only have smile. Why can I only have smile? Because Monday I had the same thing and I opened the hive up just fine but that evening when I went to go put the reducer back in place just to keep it closed up overnight and uh, all, one gal got mad and she got me. She got me. I can't smile. Mm, I look so weird. <laughs> so that's why I'm going to put my suit on. I am suiting up. I got to put my glove on here so I can do it one-handed. Don't need them on very long, just long enough to fix that. Um, entrance reducer so they have some space to go and get to their stuff so got my gloves on I just threw on my leather gloves and we're going to open this up if I can let's see here all right I forgot I can't turn the camera around while I'm filming so I had to stop and start again so we are just going to come in here and boom, look at this. All right, girls, can't sting my face this time. So, opened it up so that they have more space. And then when it cools back down, I'll close it up. It looks like it won't be too much longer until I'm just gonna take that thing off completely for honey side. It is just so cool. And we shall be hopefully doing splits soon. Got a gal coming after me. As you can see, Honey Flowers is busy, but it's not nearly as hectic has honey's hive so I'm just gonna leave the reducer as it is now um, as we warm up I will probably flip it around to the bigger entrance in the near future but right now we're just going to let them be they're not too terribly jammed up at the entrance now for some of the main things that I'm coming out here is things to show like this the Bradford pear is starting to come in bloom and I have noticed that there are bees checking it out. I've seen bees flying around this Bradford pear tree up up in the tree so I've got that going on but I've also got down here that's the Bradford pear see there's the Bradford pear and there's the hives it's right next to it. I got this other Bradford pear right here that I have set up a swarm trap. So I'm hoping to catch, I'm gonna have to refix the straps. The storms last night, it didn't get knocked down at least, but the straps does want to slide down off from it. It's not easy putting those up one-handed by myself. I mean, I have two hands when I don't have a camera, but uh, this, hopefully will catch me a swarm in fact let me turn this around well I tried turning it around in time but she flew off there were some scouts kind of checking it out I hear a bee I don't see her but I hear her so um, hopefully we'll get some free bees here soon and as you can see the Bradford pear, come on focus, oh, it's not going to focus, is coming close to blooming, which is awesome. And why don't we check out the apple tree that's right here, see how it's doing. There are a few gals I put out just because I put out two cups of sugar water, and so they're come into it and feeding a little bit give them a little bit of stuff right now while we're waiting for 
not going to focus. The apples won't be too much longer, and the apples will be in bloom. Now, here's the big thing, while I am all puffy face and funky looking, um, to talk with y'all about, and I am wanting to get some swarm partners. So I'm gonna do a little program. You obviously, you'll get honey in return, um, but I'm looking for those who would like to be swarm partners. I'm gonna get some more swarm boxes, and I'm gonna set them up actually at my parents' farm and see about catching some swarms out that way. You'll get assigned a specific box, get updates on what's happening. You'll get to see when it gets put up, um, pictures, etc. You'll get to see uh, when swarms move into the hive or the swarm catcher that you sponsor. So if you are interested in the details of being a Smoky Mountain Lash Bee Swarm Partner, let me know and I will get you the details. Otherwise, keep watching, make certain you subscribe, like the videos is a very, very big help so um, that we can keep doing these videos and having fun together. Have a great day, bye.